Have you ever wondered if everything you know about space exploration is actually true? From black holes to distant galaxies, the cosmos is a vast and intriguing place filled with mystery and wonder. Yet it's also clouded in myths and misconceptions. Perhaps you've heard about astronauts exploding in the vacuum of space or that there's no gravity in space. But how much of this is fact and how much is fiction? In this video, we will debunk the top five myths about space exploration. First off, the myth that there's no gravity in space. Now let's get this straight. Gravity, my friends, is everywhere in space. It's the invisible hand that keeps our celestial bodies in order. It's the reason why planets, like our dear Earth, orbit the sun. It's not absent, not even for a nanosecond. So why do astronauts appear weightless, you might ask? Well, it's not because there's no gravity, but because they're in free fall around the Earth. Imagine being in a lift, and suddenly the cable snaps. You'd be falling, and for a brief moment, you'd feel weightless. That's what's happening to astronauts in space, only they're falling around the Earth, not straight down. So don't be fooled by the illusion of weightlessness. It's gravity, or rather the lack of solid ground to stop the fall, that gives this impression. So the truth is, gravity is everywhere in space, even if its effects might look a bit different to what we're used to here on Earth. Next up, the myth that humans would explode in the vacuum of space. Now this is a widely held belief, often perpetuated by Hollywood blockbusters. But the reality is quite different. In the vacuum of space, without the protective bubble of our atmosphere, humans would indeed face grave dangers. However, exploding is not one of them. Instead, the lack of oxygen would cause unconsciousness within 15 seconds. Gradually, the body's tissues would start to swell due to the lowering of atmospheric pressure, a condition known as ebolism. But rest assured, this swelling wouldn't be enough to cause a human body to burst. The real threat is asphyxiation. Without oxygen, the body's vital functions would start to shut down, leading to eventual death. Hypothermia and radiation exposure are also serious concerns in the harsh environment of space. Therefore, while space is indeed a hostile environment, it wouldn't cause humans to explode. So, you can put that particular fear to rest. The third myth we're debunking is that the Great Wall of China is visible from space. Now, this is a popular belief that has been circulating for some time, but astronauts that have actually been up there confirm otherwise. From the International Space Station which orbits Earth at an altitude of around 250 miles, the Great Wall of China is simply not visible to the naked eye. But why is that, you might ask? Well, the answer lies in the structure's dimensions and materials. The Great Wall, despite its impressive length, is too narrow. It's a mere 30 feet wide on average. Moreover, it's made from materials like tamped earth and wood, which blend into the natural landscape and aren't reflective enough to stand out from space. So, while the Great Wall is a remarkable feat of human engineering and a fascinating piece of history, it doesn't quite make the cut when it comes to celestial visibility. So, despite what you might have heard, the Great Wall of China is not visible from space without the aid of telescopic lenses. The fourth myth is that space is completely silent. Now, on the surface, this notion might seem logical. After all, space is a vacuum, devoid of air or gas for sound waves to travel through, right? Well, it's not quite as simple as that. While it's true that space is a vacuum and that sound as we understand it can't travel in the conventional sense, it doesn't mean space is a silent void. You see, there are still electromagnetic vibrations that pulsate through this vast emptiness. These vibrations can be picked up by specially designed instruments on spacecraft. These instruments can then translate these vibrations into sounds that we can hear. These aren't sounds as we know them, of course, but rather a kind of cosmic noise, a hum, a crackle, a whisper of the universe itself. So while it's not exactly a symphony, space isn't as silent as you might think. The final myth we're debunking today is that astronauts' heights don't change in space. Now, wouldn't it be something if a journey among the stars could make you taller? Well, as it turns out, there's a kernel of truth to this. In the weightless environment of space, the human body experiences some intriguing changes. One of the most fascinating is a slight growth spurt. Astronauts, on average, can grow up to two inches taller during their time in space. This is due to the lack of gravity, compressing their spines, allowing the vertebrae to expand a bit. However, before you start planning your space travel to add a couple of inches to your height, it's important to note that this change is temporary. Once astronauts return to Earth and its gravitational field, 
their bodies start to feel the familiar downward pull. This causes the spine to slowly compress back to its regular size, bringing the astronauts back down to their pre-spaceflight height. It's also worth mentioning that these changes aren't always comfortable. Some astronauts experience back pain as their spine adjusts to both the expansion in space and the compression when they return to Earth. So, while a trip to space might make you feel like a giant, the growth spurt won't last forever. And that's the long and short of it, busting the myth that astronauts' heights don't change in space. So there you have it, five common myths about space exploration debunked. We've journeyed through the misconception that there's no gravity in space, when in reality it's simply that the force of gravity decreases with distance but never fully disappears. We've also clarified humans don't explode in the vacuum of space thanks to our skin's amazing ability to contain our internal pressure. We've looked at the Great Wall of China and established that it's not visible from space without aid. We've shattered the silence of space, revealing that while sound can't travel in a vacuum, space isn't completely silent. And finally, we've grown with our astronauts, understanding that their heights can indeed change in space due to the lack of gravity compressing their spine. Remember, space is full of wonders and mysteries, but it's always important to separate fact from fiction. Thanks for exploring the universe with us today.